like <laughs> listen you see what i mean <laughs> you're not bad at talking because we're Sorry. talking right now this podcast great <laughs> no. great stuff listen i am i can okay <laughs> i can talk to people that i know like pretty okay Do you not but... know me that's i mean that's what i'm trying to say like i can talk to people that i know quite okay but other than that it's i'm just a complete kinda... stranger to you that's that's what it is no no listen i can what i'm trying to say is i can talk to you pretty okay because like you know i know you but like but anything... i don't know you that well what no <laughs> but like anything like other than that it's just kind of like very hard <laughs> and it's fine it's not that bad it's still bad though <laughs> no, like i've been it's been i've been recording for a minute and so far it's great <laughs> <laughs> no you have not <laughs> have you i have but anyway um, no please 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 listen shh just let it happen it's already it's already been done you don't no, you don't even have to please. listen to it you don't you don't have to watch the video after it comes no, out no i no please listen i am not an entertaining person okay don't do this to me but anyway no. don't you want to hear about my trip to the shop uh sure but... okay so you know my mother she's been starving me again no food whatsoever so I just said enough is enough. I go to the shop, and instead of buying food, I bought four more monster cans. I'm I have an addiction, so I have two purple cans in the fridge, and then I right now I have the red one and the white one, which I have not tried. So I'm gonna start off with a taste test of the red monster, ultra red. Okay, let's 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 crack it open, shall we? <laughs> Okay, now this is this is my honest review of the ultra red. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. <laughs> you can tell I'm good at reviews. <laughs> Someone should quote me that I gave this a five star and said pretty good. <laughs> kind of like one of those kids you know and you like go into the reviews and one of them literally just says uh, it's pretty all right or you're like i saw one review of this one kid he was like reviewing what was it a game i think all he said was uh yeah <laughs> and then the person was looking at him yeah because <laughs> like it was like a video yeah then like they asked him and he just goes yeah and the person like talking to him like looked at him and he's like Nothing else. He's like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, this is pretty tasty. You know, I haven't tried the white one yet. I'll give it a bit because um, from what I've heard, I should not be drinking more than a can a day, which I haven't been doing. That's me. I can't oh. even hear you swallow. Delicious. Hold on, one more, one more. Yeah, I just gotta make sure it's it, it is good. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yep. Ah. <laughs> uh. Bro, your mic's turned up so high. It is? Mm-hmm. No, it's not. <laughs> it's on the most minimal setting there is. Is it really? It is really. <laughs> you know, I feel like... Sensitive. I think I know why... Like yesterday and today, I've just been worn out, no energy, no motivation to do whatever. And like a light bulb ticked on my head and said, I said to myself, I got it. I realized what I'm missing. My daily sugar rush. 
I'm a monster. I'm not having this monster energy in me. That's what I was missing. <laughs> and uh, they, they took a glug. I'm feeling it again. I'm, the blood's flowing, finally. So your blood wasn't flowing before? Exactly. I was a ghoul. You were what? A ghoul. You know what a ghoul oh. is? Oh, yeah. I heard. I heard you say I was Google. <laughs> I was confused. <laughs> I am Google. <laughs> but um, recently, you know, I've been trying to make this game, right? Mm -hmm. I'm not the brightest of developers, and my team consists of m me. And Pat. Pat made some music that I could use. It's pretty, pretty good. You, have you heard Pat's music? No. No? How dare no. you not he listen to Pat's music? <laughs> How dare you? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll send you um, this. One of, one of the soundtracks. Okay, let me, let me, listen, let me uh, know when you listen to it. Oh, okay. Take your time, you know, it's... It's one minute. Alright. Um... I have it on speaker, though, so... Is it playing? Uh-huh. Why am I lucky scared there's gonna be a red pill somewhere along there? There isn't. Why does it Loki sound like something that would be in those like old school horror games? You know what I mean? Mm hmm. I mean, once it hits the minute, you know, the beat drops and it's pretty good. I mean, yeah, I like it. That's him playing the guitar, like, bruh. Oh really? Yeah, it's he's pretty good at it. Cool. I mean, yeah, I like it. Um, when I was talking to him, like the first time I met him, I was referred to him from by uh Chris. And um, Chris is the guy in the vibe server. Yeah. And uh, Chris, you know, told me about Pat, and Pat was told about me by Chris. And then I I call him. But uh, he's not really good at English, he says, so he just typed me most of the stuff. Mm -hmm. And I told him about the big idea for the, for this game. And, you know, he, and he says he'll try. And I really enjoyed his music, you know, and everyone else did. Like, mm -hmm. I, I was streaming and then everyone was like, yeah, this, this sounds pretty good. And then after I end the call, he DMs me. <laughs> He he goes, by the way, I'm kind of shaking right now. I'm just 14 and kind of scared. Aww. <laughs> and I, I don't know if he was intimidated by me or, or something like that. But, um, uh, you know, I, I had those times, you know, bef before, you know, when I was like 12 or 13 and I was hanging out on calls with like, like older people than me. And, um, and I have those times, all, like, I have that all the time. It doesn't matter if the person's older or not. All the time? <laughs> I used to have that. And then nowadays, since I uh, got older and wised up, I, I speak to an older person. I'm like, yeah, fuck you. And I don't care any <laughs> anymore. But, um, yeah, I mean, he's a good kid. <laughs> he knows how to play guitar at 14. Like, jeez. 
You also have to make some good music. I mean, I know this one kid. He's also like, what, 13 or 15? He's pretty good at guitar as well. But I haven't talked to him in a long time. I've had um such an ego, 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 ego <laughs> boost. <laughs> ego. <laughs> uh-huh. I've had. <laughs> I've I've had a I've had an an ego boost recently <laughs> by a lot of people. Um, so I was making this game and I was like, like kind of questioning myself, like should should I might be streaming this or I shouldn't. And then mm-hmm. people, like Pat told me that uh, I should keep stre- Everyone said I should keep streaming making the game. Because mm-hmm. apparently I, uh, some of them look up to me. Like Doctor, um, he uh, donated a lot of bits. And um, he, he uh, says that thanks to me he got back into streaming. And Pat says that... Uh, he came into my chat once and then he was appreciative, like, you know, that he's making a soundtrack now for a game. Mm-hmm. And then a bunch of people were, like, learning from me making a game. They were learning along with me. Right. Which was cool. I didn't think I'd be <laughs> doing much, but... Yeah, you know, it's very... It's pretty cool. I mean, yeah, it sounds pretty cool. What about you? Do you look up to me? <laughs> <laughs> Am I your icon? Oh, uh, strange question. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't think anyone goes up to you like, hey, aren't I your <laughs> idol? <laughs> uh, never really thought of it that way. Um, I need to hit a brand though. About a keyboard? No. The uh, he does drums drumming. Oh, right. <laughs> you know, Bram's one as the keyboard guy and that's all he's good for. <laughs> no, I never said that. <laughs> that's what you meant. No. I just find him guilty. <laughs> mm-hmm. But um, I never he has said other good been. qualities. I'm aware, okay. <laughs> so. Good. But anyway, um, I've heard of like Bram that he's really into like drumming. You know, mm-hmm. I every time he puts this on on his cam, he just like pretends that he's drumming. No, I've heard him like proper drum before, and it's pretty good. Pretty good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I, I was trying to get like a sample of what he does. I, I haven't heard it myself personally, mm-hmm. but I was interested. Um, so in this like small little team that I have, I still haven't thought of a, a team name, right? You know how there's like Face Punch Studios and stuff like that. I don't have mm-hmm. my own name for my group. Which would make things a lot quicker if I could set a, a, up a group and so far I'm the only one actually working on the physical game itself which sucks you know I wish th- there was someone else and I'm trying mm-hmm. to look out for more people I just can't find anybody like I have Mohammed but all he give right now is giving me some assets and that hasn't helped in my situation. Mm-hmm. Perk, I asked her to make a, a, re- a, re- a drawing. You know that koala thing I did? Mm-hmm. I told her to just recreate that in her style. And the only drawing she has done is just draw a cat. She just drew a cat. <laughs> <laughs> I can show you the exact thing, but she just drew a cat. <laughs> Seems like her priorities are straight. Yep. He knows what she wants. <laughs> I mean, the cat drawing is pretty good. But 
But. But. Mm. Um. I need to just look out more, and find people. Cause uh, you know, you know, F and F, you know, I just that game was made by four people, and it's such a great game. Like one programmer, one artist, and one guy that makes music, and another person that does something else. But they just all just make made a sick game. If I can just get people, and then maybe we could uh game that'd be that'd be Paul to make a cool game but my only issue is i just need to get better at this programming thing it's really not my expertise yet but i do like coding so i need to get better at it and i will i mean good for you. i need to like study a lot of coding as well because i'm gonna have to do uh what's it called like from school you know we're gonna have like a because i'm going from chemistry to like the other class which has like a bunch of like coding and shit like that so i'm gonna have to basically do a test from like a whole like year worth of materials you're gonna need to learn coding i mean i already know some coding but yeah pretty much i'm gonna have to like do a bunch of like what coding shit. language uh not just one like they've gone through Hold on, okay. okay, they've gone through like more, but I need to like look into exactly what they did to make sure that I can like catch up. So the way I see it is, uh, wait, what uh, what skill level would you say your coding knowledge is at? Like right now? Beginner, in intermediate, or expert? Oh god, <laughs> uh, between like absolute beginner and like uh. And to me, I don't know, like something between. I'm not sure. Okay. Know. Like I've took like coding classes before. You know, we've done some shit, but I've I have the only coding class I've done is build a website using HTML. It's just pretty oh. simple. <laughs> I enjoyed it. I loved every bit of it. Probably the most useful and funnest class I've ever done in and ever in school. Yeah, I mean, we did like web page coding as well last year i believe but um we also did a like we started like a lot of python last year so we did i did like a little program that was like when you ran it basically it was like consisted of like four parts the first one was basically like a little game where you what is that game called you know like when you have like a like okay like a little like ball, basically. Oh, like, the going gonna from... bounce off a platform. Yeah, yeah. So like that, yeah. and then if you got like a score above, I don't remember, like fifty, I think. I I'm not sure, but if you got like a high enough score, it took you to like the second, you know, part of the program, and it was like basically like four like simple games. That's... I mean, they weren't as simple as you think, because like it took quite a bit, <laughs> but um. Yeah, and then, like, the second one was basically, like, you were trying to, um, <clears throat> you were trying to, like, I don't know how to explain it. I would have to find it to know exactly, but there was these, like, you were trying to find, there was this, like, little, like, map, and you were basically, like, trying to find, um, what were they? I'm not sure, like, everyone got, like, something else, you know, like, whatever like stars or whatever mm -hmm. the fuck and you would need to like look into these like uh they kind of look like chests a little bit and like you've gone through like a bunch of like you had to get through um uh like some puzzles and stuff like that and then once you got through that you know and like it just kept like getting like harder like each game so we did that, and then that was, like, one of the tests that we did for, like, Python. Mm -hmm. And then once we ended with that, we moved on to Java for a little while. But that wasn't, you know, too long. Have you done anything that, on C-sharp? On C-sharp? Uh, I'd say, yeah, but just, like, not much. We basically were doing, like, Python most of the time, so C-sharp was maybe, maybe around, like, two weeks i think like two weeks worth of lessons 
Okay. Yeah, not much, really. Hear me out, okay? So, me learning all this C-sharp coding, I can put on a resume, I can be, like, expert coder and stuff like that. So, like, even this game, like, I'm learning C-sharp, and that's, a, that's an actual skill I can use in the future. So, I could offer you to learn C-sharp with me, and work on the game together. What do you say? I mean, it's something to do, right? You know, because I have no, no games to play, nothing to watch, so I might as well just do something with my time. And I found that making a game would be it. Right. I mean, it's fair. But I don't know. <laughs> I have, like, quite a bit of stuff from school as well. But maybe if I find the time to, I mean, sure. Listen, I guess. Like, the end of the year is coming up. We're all about to finish. That's true. You know, and then we have all the time in the world after that. I mean, sure, you know, maybe over summer. Okay, bet. Over summer. <laughs> okay. Anyways. That'll be it for today's podcast episode. <laughs> Wait, no, you weren't actually... Recording, been 21 right? minutes and counting no. please listen and the end <laughs>